Hello, my name is Eno Taiwo. I'm the host of a talk show, Pearls with Eno, and um, the director of the initiative, Pearls with Eno Initiative. Speak for Gold, indeed, has been an awesome experience. It is wow. It is something that I can't really describe the feeling and uh, the benefits. I got to know about Speak for Gold on an IG Life session um, FD had with a US Marina and um, he was sharing his story. In my heart, I really wanted to attend it because part of my plans for myself during the COVID was personal developments. I work with teenagers, I work with young adults. Sometimes I have interface with adults as well, parents and family. So I wanted to develop myself. I wanted to learn many skills, many things on how to do it. And for my brand as well, I wanted to have a structure. I know my vision, I know my why, I know my what. I know who I'm supposed to be speaking with and who I was born to address. But I needed the right structure for this brand. And also, I needed to get a fee from what I was doing because the passion in me was just going into the vision. But then there was really nothing coming in for me. So honestly, as a passionate individual, you're not really working for gain. But I found out in Speak for Gold that my passion and my gifts actually makes way for me. This is a very valuable thing that I got because honestly, I was doing this vision with my whole heart and really expecting nothing much. But the truth of the matter is, to be able to run any initiative, to be able to add value, something to must be coming in. And I learned this at Speak for Gold. And the guilt feeling that I had when I was also desiring and earning from it is gone. And I'll just say a few things that I learned over the course of the study. First of all, I learned about perspective and that the experiences which I've gone through may be a misleading factor, especially in a time of change. So because everything is determined, our perspective determines everything. How do I see things? I also learned about self-mastery. I should master myself over living a life of mystery. I should understand my purpose. Also, I learned that my name is the address for the solution I offer. I learned about the effective success. A lot of us are doing things. A lot of people are doing things and they term it success. But it's at a much later point in their life, they find out that that success was not God's intention for them. And hence, it's a defective success. They've succeeded, yes, but was that what God wanted for them? Was that the place? Was that the timing? That is what they have to find out for themselves. I also learned about etiquette plus online visibility. I also learned that ambition without implementation is a ridiculous delusion. So we have to implement all that we plan. Yes, we all have great dreams, but we have to implement them being predictable in whatever you're doing. If you're doing an online business or an online, you have an online platform, you have to be predictable and be consistent, be authentic. In fact, I learned about boundaries. There were so many things to learn, but I'm just so grateful for this opportunity. FD and team, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. And for my friends, I've reached out to a lot of my friends because honestly, this experience is priceless. I've met a wonderful group I'm in a team called the Pure Gold Tribe. And I know God has great plans for us. Thank you all. Thank you, FD. Thank you, team. God bless you. Speak for Gold has made 2020 a year to remember for a totally different reason, a new beginning. I'd like to thank my dear friend, Funke Oduto, 
who experienced something so impactful and thought of me. Each day was better than the last. And just when I felt it couldn't get any better, you introduced us to Mr. Bancolet Williams, the science man. I've never been a great speaker. I've always felt my strengths lay in my ability to connect with people on a personal level. Speak for Gold has taught me that I have a voice and the importance of sharing my voice and my message with those I was sent to connect with. I'd like to thank FD, Simi, Uju, David, and everyone who has made this transformational experience possible. Thank you for accepting me into this tremendous tribe. I am eternally grateful to you all. This is Rosemary Obi, also known as RM, the Millionaire Boss Lady. Um, Speak for Gold for me has been nothing, nothing short of explosive. Um, it's been a wow um, week. Oh my God, back to back, being loaded with awesome nuggets, awesome teachings. Wow. FD has emptied himself into everyone this week and it is my prayer that God refills him, replenishes him and waters him beyond expectation. For me, Speak for Gold has been a confirmation for the mission God has set me on for 2020. Every year, I ask God for my personal theme, regardless of what the theme in my church is, you know, whatever theme they choose, fine, that's a general theme. But for me, I always ask God, of course, I started this culture three years back, no, two years back in 2018. 2018, I asked God and he said, make impact. And then I started my CSR initiative in 2018 and even won an award. Guess what? It was the most impactful impact, the most impactful entrepreneur in Africa. I had experienced um, the Speak for Gold in 2016. Um, Mrs. Tara Feladurutoye had um, hosted a TFD series where she invited um, Mommy Ibukun Awoshika and then our Papa FD was also invited and that was on March 22nd, 2016. Three months before I was to launch a Pan-African mission. I was still scared. I was still feeling so unsure about everything. I didn't know what to do. And then I attended this class. And when I got to this class, FD was on fire back to back. You know when FD is dishing it out. <laughs> and then he gave a line. Of course, I wrote, I think, I wrote up to 10 pages that day. But one line resonated so much with what I was to do in a few months time. He said, helping A to find B so that C. Wow, okay, so I can encapsulate my mission in this one liner and then I'll have clarity. Okay, let's give it a try. So I did. I put it all together and then three months after I was able to launch it. I remember before um, TFD series, I was praying in the middle of the night and I was asking God what he wanted me um, to do concerning the mission he had put in my heart because I got the word, um, I got the name of the mission project FX Africa while I was praying, one of my women, um, um, fellowship uh, programs at uh, one of uh, the programs and then um, I was asking God how he wanted me to run with it and then he said Africa I remember tapping my husband I, I literally woke him up in the middle of the night and said honey honey God said Africa and then you know what my husband said he said oh it's Africa you have heard and you're shaking and crying like this if I were you I will quickly go and sleep before God says world I was like, this man is not even helping matter. But I, I actually was out laughing because I was like, look at this man making, <laughs> making light what was so heavy in my heart. But it helped because I was able to see that if God sends you, he will provide. And that is what FD has confirmed again this week, reminding us that for every assignment we've been sent, there is provision. I'm just so blessed that yet again, 
I'm experiencing the speak for gold. Yvette Baker, one of my crazy friends, like we are not normal in my clique of friends. So she's one of the abnormal people, <laughs> abnormal for God. Um, she called me and she was like, Aram, you're not on WhatsApp. And I said, yes, I'm on a social media fast because at that period, God required of me to retreat for 21 days. So I was on a 21 day Daniel fast. And then she called me and she was like, Aram, I want you to, to, to enroll for the speak for gold and everything. Thank God for her because I would have missed this particular cohort. I, I wasn't on social media, so there was no way I could have known that a speak for gold, um, program was to happen in November. And then I said, don't worry, because she was selling so hard. She was trying to tell me, I remember, I'll give you back the money if at the end of the training, you don't get your money's worth. And I was like, hold it right there, sis. You don't need to sell FD to me. I have benefited from his wife and himself. And then she was like, yeah, 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 when? I said in 2016. She was like, ah, you don't tell me. I said, no, I don't know you that time. <laughs> I was like, we, I mean, in 2016, I didn't know anybody called Yvette. And then that was when it dawned on her. She was like, oh, I remember you don't really enjoy this thing since. Anyway, to cut the long story short, I enrolled the next day because I needed to hear from God that he wanted me to do it at the time. So I enrolled for it the next day. And of course, God, it wasn't part of my budget for the month. And then it just happened to be there. And I, I just paid for it. And I'm grateful to God for that. So I'm grateful for the blessing you are that you are um fd you are emptying yourself per time you have emptied yourself into us i mean this the one liner you gave me that i'm still running with helping a to find b so that c i have gone ahead to teach my mentees to the glory of god i have about 40 mentees that i hold by the hand show them the way giving them an ear to listen a brain to pick basically so that they don't miss it in life because i am a purpose junkie like i'm all about purpose for very little things i'm always like what's the purpose of that thing because i know there's always a reason there's a reason i have this phone there's a reason i have the lights the light stand that is providing light for this recording there's a reason for everything so it's always easier when you know the reason for the existence of something so that you can know what to do concerning that thing or concerning that journey. So I'm grateful to God that I'm experiencing another speak for gold. So for me, it is a confirmation because God told me to keep emerging this year. So he, what it literally means is keep developing yourself, get better, get better. For the coming year and i'm wrapping up this year with speak for gold i'm so excited to have joined this cohort because it's filled with power packed women and men i have connected with a few of them and oh my the world ain't ready for what is going to come out from this family thank you so much for the new friends i'm grateful thank you fd thank you see me whoa your whole vibe. Um, thank you, Ju. Wow. Thank you so much. The Gemstone Tribe, you guys rock. Thank you so much, FD, for what you do, for all you do for humanity all, ar all around the world. Um, people see you and all they think of is the motivation master. You can't listen to FD and remain the same. Never. So I have filled up my notes for the journey ahead. And I know that I won't get it wrong. Because you chose to heed the call. Thank you so much.